Evan, just the sheriff says if you get pulled over, whether it's by a marked car like this one or an unmarked car like the one behind me here, the main thing that you need to look out for to know if it's real are those red and blue lights and sirens. Come on out if you don't mind. We, we don't understand why he was here. Jackson Jones arrested after allegedly flashing his headlights and pulling over cars in Choctaw. Check you for make sure you don't have any guns or nothing. Dressed in this vest, marked sheriff, carrying handcuffs, knives, a flashlight, and wearing a duty belt. If you wouldn't mind, go ahead and take the vest off and just sit it in the car. This is not his first time Jackson got stopped for possibly <laughs> impersonating law enforcement. It's honestly really dangerous. I and mean, when we see the times that we're in and, you know, what law enforcement enforcement officers are going through on the day to day. Um, why you would put yourself in this situation, I don't know. Body but, camera um, video uh, shows deputies questioning Jones and patting down his vest. So do you wear this vest carrier on duty? No. In the jail? I mean, like I can. He claimed he worked for Campbell County Sheriff's Office in Tennessee. Jones never showed proof of employment with any law enforcement agency. Witnesses say he was parked in a driveway ready to pretend he was on the job. He goes, I'm an undercover cop for Wellston. And I run, uh, my partner, I run with the highway patrolman. And he took Huey and was trying to pull another car. He started flashing his lights at him. Really? And I, I didn't know if, if they pulled over or not, but he was flashing his lights like he was trying to pull them over. I was like, he's kind of strange. Now the sheriff warns the community about imposters like Jones. Should anyone come in contact in this situation and you have any second thoughts or, man, maybe I need to check, call 911. You'll see a badge, you'll see patches, and they'll also have IDs, just like I wear on my chest to let you know that I am certified with the law enforcement agency. And Jones is being held in the Oklahoma County Jail on a $1,000 bond. Now, guys, the sheriff tells me that he's never seen a case like this come across his desk, but he wants to make sure that the community is aware and alert in case it happens to you.